has become a symbol of so much that is tragic but avoidable in our world. Today, we come bearing gifts for the children of war-torn Sarajevo. Are our most precious resource. Our mission is to provide immediate relief efforts to children in need throughout the world. This evening, Mr. and Mrs. Jackson have committed to take care of all of the financial responsibility for our liver transplant for the young man upstairs. Heal the World has supported programs in 21 countries providing ambulances, vaccines, toys, and supplies to children's hospitals, arranged for children with disabilities and terminal illnesses to visit backstage at Michael's concerts. These children are a reminder of the preciousness of all life. Heal the World is organizing the World's Children's Congress made up of delegates aged 8 to 16. Michael's work with disadvantaged young people and those with disabilities reflect his profound commitment to children. We can face up to the problem of drinking and driving. And we can in my... Heal LA was established to work with community groups to provide mentoring programs, drug prevention education, and develop a community school safe havens initiative. Michael's experience with USA for Africa's We Are the World demonstrated the power of the music community to mobilize people for an urgent cause. That biggest selling single in history helped to raise over $60 million to aid the famine victims of Africa. Then Michael gave us a new international anthem. The mission of Heal the World, my mission, is healing, pure and simple. On behalf of VH1, we'd like to present this award to you for the work that you've done over the years for so many charities. And in addition, VH1 is proud to, listen to this now, VH1 is proud to announce the creation of a special VH1 International Honors Award for the King of Pop, which will be presented in future years to artists whose worldwide charitable work follows in the footsteps of yourself. I'm a major fan. He's phenomenal. Um, thank you, Morgan, for your words. Thank you, VH1. <laughs> uh -huh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for this honor. And thank you. <laughs> thank you, all my friends and fans, for your love and support. You've given me so much. It's allowed me to take some of that love and pass it on to those people whose problem in this world need and deserve our help. A perfect example is the recent UN announcement that one to three million lives could be saved if third world children were given a vitamin A pill three times a year. Cost per child is just six cents, that's all. So we must join together in healing the world so we can share this beautiful planet in joy and love. I love you very much. But there's a couple of people I have to thank who made this possible. First, I'd like to thank um, God, who makes all things possible. My mother, Joseph Jackson, Catherine Jackson, Trudy Green, Howard Kaufman, the genius of John McLean, John Branca, Barry Gordy, Diana Ross, Gladys Knight, Quincy Jones, I love you, David Blaine, your magic is real and I believe in you. And I'd like to thank I think James Brown is a genius. Uh, and 
all the fans around the world, I love you. God bless you. Thank you. But nobody was prepared what would come next. Cause this is thriller! Thriller! Sorry. Thriller stayed on the Billboard 200 for nearly two years, spending a racket 37 weeks at number one. It won dozens of awards, including a racket eight Grammys. He gave me one of them. It set another Billboard racket when seven of his nine tracks reached the top ten, and Michael became the first artist at Billboard chart history to simultaneously and single-handedly album charts both on black and pop charts. I messed that up. I know y'all seen it, but that's all right. <laughs> Quite simply, Thriller Skills remains the biggest selling album in the history of the world, period. That's why I'm thrilled to present this award to the king of pop, Michael Jackson. Thank you so much. I'm very honored. I'm very happy. I thank all the people that appreciate my work. I thank the Billboard Awards. I've always admired you. And to the fans around the world, I love you. I couldn't be me without you. Thank God. And Chris Tucker, you're my favorite. Can I keep the award for a couple of days? <laughs> yeah, we got to share it. No, we have to share it. Where well, I'm staying at the Neverland. Yeah, uh, anywhere you want to stay. All right. I'm in cabin number three. <laughs> okay. Hey, what's up, Thank you so much. Thank y'all. Hey, how are you? Mike, where Bubbles at, man? How the monkey doing? Ain't nobody heard from the monkey in a while, Mike. How the monkey doing, man? He's at Chris Tucker's house. <laughs> Chris Tucker got the monkey, man. Right on, man. Chris, what's up, brother, y'all? Big ups. Hey, y'all, coming to I'm, the stage. I, I'm a big fan of yours, by the way. Right on, Mike. Big fan here, too, man. I know all the songs. Me, too, Cedric. I still got... <laughs> I love you. You I know this, funny. man. <laughs> you know this, man. Right on, y'all. Big up, Chris. That's the new Rush Hour.